Oh, yeah, he found the bridge thing. Look at this fucking guy. Hmm. Hit him so hard his eyes got fixed. <laughs> but yeah, oh, the bridge thing, uh, because you walk over to here and they're like, hope he doesn't find the switch in the bridge, or the, the switch to the bridge in the bushes. And you're like, shake, shake, shakey, shake, and this thing appears. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to bring the whole goddamn regime down on him. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh. Oh, his eyes. Oh, the good fat and all that. I must warn you. If you happen to find a strange switch somewhere, you should definitely not press it. It's dangerous, understand? <laughs> you what? You already pressed it? I feel like that's slightly offensive. <laughs> oh. oh, no. Well, like, he's, he's the brute. That he can't has, quite talk right. He has to be stupid. What the fuck? Oh. Oh, no. Someone's precious artwork. Someone's precious paperwork. Uh, <laughs> oh, no. This castle isn't real. Look, the windows come right off. <laughs> it's a cannon. Oh, snap, really? What the F? <laughs> I've been watching too many, like... What the F? Team Rocket Blast and Opa God! <laughs> I've been watching those, like, you know, those David Blaine, those old David Blaine parody videos. Oh, yeah. And I was like, what the F? Jesus! The F? Mikey Day, that's his name. Yeah, it was comedian. really funny. I want to see what's back here. And now that I've actually seen David Blaine, I'm like, that's so accurate. He really is like that. He stares you in the eyes, like... He's like, he's like, would you just... And he, like, repeats himself a lot. He's like, look at that. I just, uh, can you see that? Yeah, he's yeah. Got, yeah David Blaine, I can see it. Yeah, he'll just say it over and over while he's Whoa, doing a trick. It's, and it's funny. Woo, super shrimp. It works with ten instead of five. <laughs> Sorry, I didn't mean to cut you off from your David Blaine story. I know, that was it, basically. <laughs> Who's there? <laughs> she said, how long have you been She's there? Just up there like sour, like what the fuck? How'd they do that? I can't fucking trust them with anything. <laughs> oh found, god dang it! They even found that super mushroom. Shit! Saving continue. That means she's watching you all the time. <laughs> when you're sleeping, when you're eating, when you're taking a shower. A shower. I was trying. I'm trying when to. You're do trying to take a shower. I was trying to do that, Brannigan. <laughs> oh, I thought you were trying to. So I like trying to take a shit. Mighty What's her voice again? Was it Tap Tabitha? But Tabitha. I, don't, I forget her name. Mighty King Bowser, I've been looking for you. I report oh, your evilness. Mighty defeated the Goomba King. He's headed for Toad Town now. Oh. He didn't even have the super jump. I don't know how he did it. That's the first time I've seen her touch the ground. <laughs> Look at her little feet. <laughs> <laughs> Bowser's like, what are those? <laughs> what? Unbelievable! What was Goomba? Fuck, everyone has the same voice but me. <laughs> I used the star rod to make him a king because he begged me. <laughs> and Mario whips him so easily. What a whip! <laughs> uh, Cammy. Coop. Yeah, her name was Cammy, dog. You are sure that Mario can never defeat us, right? Please, please, your vileness. Try to be calm. Goomba King a small time. I had a feeling he'd fail. Why'd you waste my time? <laughs> yeah. Why'd you make him a why'd you make me make him a king then? <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't matter because while you hold the star rod, you are definitely invincible. <sighs> <laughs> Got a pack of Marbras. Do you mind if I smoke? No, I don't mind. <laughs> I don't, that's a weird smelling cigarette. It smells it smells herbal. <laughs> <laughs> Very good. <laughs> <laughs> By the way, Gabby Goomba, those star spirits we captured. <coughs> Can you take that cigarette out? <laughs> <laughs> Don't have any way of giving. Oh, there, it's the Kami's voice. That room is a little heavy. <laughs> Murray, they power, do they? Please don't worry yourself. Age is held separately. It's like DLC. They're all bought separately. <laughs> if you want the full package, you have to pay twenty nine ninety nine, And each is carefully guarded by your hand-picked subjects. Math, English, social studies. <laughs> <laughs> like, Ed Mario goes to, like, capture a star spirit and he has to do a calculus equation. He's like, oh, god dang it! <laughs> then they give him, like, one number two pencil and, like, a peppermint. <laughs> do you fucking remember In two that? hours yeah. to complete it. Do you remember that? Oh, yeah, uh, used, SATs. Yeah, they used to give us... No, not the SATs, dude. It, uh, AC, it was just like standardized testing. It was like every time they do it, they would give you, like, a pepper, like two peppermints. Right, but in fact, like, they read the study wrong. Hmm. Like, cause I'm gonna take a drink of this delicious dew. So go ahead and explain the story a little bit. Well, long story short, people used to think like that peppermint. Well, it that it opens up your 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 memory, or at least that's what they told us in school. But right. It only works if when they're teaching you, you're you're doing it. That they give you one of those candies, so you associate that taste with what you've learned throughout the year. But they didn't do that. They just gave us candy during the test, so it actually distracts your brain. 
So. <laughs> Look at these fucking guys, just real quick. I'm gonna know these fucking tools, man. Cosplaying is the fucking. Uh, Turtles in a half shell. Co Turtle power. <laughs> Cosplaying is the freaking Goodwill Night Ninja Turtles. <laughs> knock, knock, knock. You're about to get shelled. You're about to get fucking <laughs> discounted. <laughs> Kami Cooper, are you sure? Oh, the voice will change, I swear, like 20 times. <clears throat> are you sure these. Oh, fuck. I give up. <laughs> That Goomba King was gigantic, and even he couldn't beat Mario. Would you shut up, you invincible Psst, Get real, ass. King Bowser. Yeah, yeah the <laughs> Goomba King was huge, but we ain't got nothing with Polar. We're nothing like him. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> 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 okay, so we got going on his power teamwork. <laughs> <laughs> they call me D'Angelo. <laughs> D'Angelo. <laughs> just... They call me Miguel. <laughs> Excellent, that's the spirit salad, Koopa bro. <laughs> My name's Stellance. <laughs> Stellance. I love that name, it's so cool to me. Joe King, that special attack you do so well. <laughs> the voodoo that you do. Nah, 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 nah. I just love their like fat faces. Do the voodoo that you do so well. Oh, well that was accurate actually. <laughs> oh. <laughs> that is, that is, oh. Yeah. <laughs> I love it. How'd you like it, King Bowser? How was it? <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> Excellent, <laughs> really. I'm not easily impressed, either. <laughs> oh, my God. Mario won't have a chance if you finish him with that attack. <laughs> oh, no. The Big Bang attack. <laughs> but what about the suspenders? Won't they get in the way? <laughs> Just so how, so how do you... <laughs> so how do you use that hoister again? <laughs> This is like a lot of unnecessary work. Oh, uh, no one, sir. You know, we healing, so, um, you idiots! Use your heads! Get back to the fortress and guard that star spirit! So pretty much what happened was, he's like, if you're here, then who's guarding the star spirit? And they're like, uh, no, no one, I guess. Can you open your, memory, your, your menu real quick? Sure. Something I think's funny. It says, party and spirits. Where? Like, right, right up there. Oh, it's yeah. like in, you know, an, an RPG, you know, party, and then you've got your spirits, but also... Got a map. It sounds like of like a grocery list for, like, a banging party. Night, night on the town. Uh-huh. And? Well, I don't know. That was, that's pretty much the, the was, end of that. I was, I was like, where are you going with this? That was the height of my imagination. I, I, was, sitting, I, was, like, where, I was like, where are you going with this? Maybe I can help him somehow. <laughs> I definitely needed it. <laughs> and there's a treasure chest up here, and... Are there, are there mim mimics in this game? You mean mimics? Like fake treasure chests are actually creatures? I don't think so. Oh god. I could be wrong, but god. I, I don't think so. I freaking hate mimics. Yes, yeah, it's, it's not fucking, uh, it's not Dark Souls. <laughs> oh yeah, by the way, we're in Toe Town right now. Oh! Oh! Mario, I'm tell. so glad you're okay! The town is an uproar! The princess kidnapped! It's Mary Castle of Rodin! It's Bedlam! Who uses Bedlam? Subtitles help. Meow. Meow. Please, Mario, save her highness. I've been watching. What was it? It was. Um, I don't know. What have you been watching? Familiar of Zero. And there's like a guy in it who's like a grown man, but he. Well, he's like, I guess in the show, he'd be considered like trans. Mm. So, like. In one episode, he's wearing like a cat, like hat thing, and he just goes like, "Nyaw," but it's just really funny to put in situations. <laughs> Nyaw. Uh, dude, I love. Oh yeah, these guys, these dogs. Homo erotic characters yeah. are the best. Good to meet you, bud. Ralph's the name. Like I'm, gonna... starting, I'm starting me up a little business in Toad Town. Is it a cigarette shop? <laughs> <laughs> I'm still setting up. Ja, we we'll see you back here when we open. I. Right? He, he, I swear, he, that, look at this dog, the, the, the bigger one, this one. Doesn't dogs? he look like, yeah, Rar is his name, or Ralph. He looks like a camel. No, he's a fucking camel. <laughs> you know what, that's what, exactly what he is. Doesn't he look like he would have the voice of Ice-T? Yes. <laughs> right? Because Ice it, just, it just looks like Ice, because Ice-T looks like a camel. <laughs> Let's be real here. Oh. oh, oh, I wonder who these guys are. Oh, it's totally toads, right? Oh. It's dangerous out there. I wouldn't go. Yeah, you shouldn't go. Nope, no go. Sorry, but no. <laughs> uh, shows. I so, didn't realize there was a slam poetry session out in the middle so, of the town. So, does your gorillas have personalities too, or do they just copy you? <laughs> I think I go. Wait, I'm trying to remember. Which way do I go? I love that they. Because I'm supposed to. I'm supposed to go like. Spoiler alert! I'm supposed to go this way. In case you couldn't tell, with the. uh 
clearly toads. Look at their fucking smug ass faces. Clear, clearly, I mean, clearly, um, clearly that, that, that I'm not supposed to go this way, because clearly they're toads, and they're not, um, enemies whatsoever with the black heads and the fucking evil look on. What are you trying? Whoa! Whoa! What are you trying to say? Whoa! And, okay, he's just telling you about, um, the town. He's pretty much your tour guide, and we'll go over here, because I think you might have to go here. Merlin is out. Oh. Where the fuck did he go? <laughs> out! I hate it when people say, I hate that. Where it's like, I mean, I understand, like, you're trying to, like, people's, like, trying to be nosy. You're like, uh, where'd he go? But if you're like, hey, I got a package for someone, or like, hey, I'm looking for him. I need to ask him a question. Be like, where did he go? Out. Oh, um, can you tell me where he went? Out. Oh, okay. What Thank you. That? What? That? What the fuck? It's a... It's um, it's a spooky ghost. Totally not a dojo by any means. <laughs> it's just weird that I, he's got like a turtle on a leash. Huh? Oh, that's that is really really weird. I'm supposed to go somewhere. I'm gonna end the episode, <laughs> and maybe we'll figure out where we're supposed to go. So um, see you guys in the next episode. <laughs> oh, bye.